What? Jeff Beamish is bringing a gift from Mother Nature because this weather has been awesome, Ooh, Jeffrey. Cool. It has. It's the gift that keeps on giving this October here in Tucson. Live look outside. This is our News 4 Tucson Skynet cam on the northwest side over at River in Lechoya. Cool start for the morning rush. It will be blustery through the afternoon and evening hours. Mid 70s for your daytime highs. Plenty of sunshine. Those winds gusting as high as 20 miles per hour prevailing out of the east southeast. Overall today, temperatures about 10 degrees below average for this time of year, and that'll be followed up with nighttime lows into the 40s and 50s. Wouldn't be shocked if a few spots in the Sulphur Springs Valley in eastern Cochise County dropping into the upper 30s by daybreak tomorrow. Regarding the winds today, for the most part, 10 to 20 miles per hour prevailing through the evening hours. A few spots may approach 25 mile per hour gusts and won't be till about 10, 11 o'clock tonight that these breezes start to dial back to the 5 to 15 mile per hour range. Reason the Sonoran wind machine cranking up today, area of low pressure all wound up in the northwestern corner of the state. This low not going anywhere anytime soon. It's progress being blocked by a strong dome of high pressure over the Pacific Northwest. This pattern called a Rex block really won't break until the weekend and early next week as this low slowly meanders through the state. In the process, rain chances back in the forecast starting Saturday. Best bet for showers Sunday and Monday. Gusty southwest winds also returning to the forecast with the exception of Saturday. Daytime highs through early next week will run below average. Should be in the mid 80s this time of year. We'll get there Saturday, but that's the exception to the rule over the next seven days here. Forewarn extended forecast. Gradual warming trend now through the first half of the weekend by Saturday, a 20% chance of showers increasing to 30% Sunday and Monday. Good news here with the forecast this weekend. If you have outdoor plans, I don't think we replicate what we saw last weekend with widespread rain. So your outdoor plans should be a okay. Just know you'll have to dodge a few raindrops heading into your Saturday and Sunday.